Hey there guys, Trogdor here, and welcome to another redstone tutorial. Today I have for you a, another uh, spiral door. Somebody told me the old one broke. So I decided just to throw this together. It's based off the other uh, normal door design. Uh, so, as you can see, it looks very similar to the last one. Uh, anyways, let's uh, test this out. And as you can see, it opens up nice and smoothly. This one actually opens up more smoothly than the old spiral door. So, it's got a better animation, honestly. But yeah, anyways guys, let's get on with the tutorial. Okay guys, so this build is going to fit in the 3x7 area uh, in the diamond blocks. So that's 7 this way, 3 this way. And your floor is going to end up being 4 high, so... That's your floor level right there. So we're going to start off by coming up here. This will be the front. We'll be placing a temporary block right there. And two sticky pistons right there. So what we're doing now is just making the frame for the actual door. So we're using uh, quartz blocks as blocks of choice. So put a block there. A black there and a black there and temporary one there three high like that same thing over here you can get rid of those then we're going to place in our pistons up here so you're gonna go up two from one of these and you're gonna place a piston face in a sticky piston facing down on that block and then you're going to do that another two times right there like that then you can get rid of those and then you can place three uh, blocks of choice right there then we need a sticky piston right there so we'll place a temporary block like that We'll place a sticky piston like that, facing that way. Then we need to place another two sticky pistons right here. You can get rid of that now. We need two sticky pistons on this side. And there you go. That's the basic frame for the door itself. Now we're going to also bring these out another two. These are all blocks of choice because you'll be able to see them. So just place these like so. And there you go. Okay. The next thing we're going to do is uh, make the closing circuit. And we're also going to place in our T flip. So let's come over to the back side of this. Right below this block, all the way on the floor. Go place a temporary block there. Go place a dropper on top of that, facing up. And then we're going to place a dropper right there, facing that way, on top of that one. We can get rid of this block. Then we're going to place a hopper into the bottom dropper. Put an item in that hopper. Then place a comparator on top of that hopper. Like that. That's our T flip flop. Now for the closing circuit I'm going to be using yellow stain clay. So I'm going to place a block down there like that. A block up there like that. 
Then I'm going to take an observer, place it right there, facing into that bottom uh, piston. I'm going to place a redstone dust right there, like that. Uh, I can come up here and replace this because it will pop up there like that. Then I'm going to place a block there with a repeater, put it on four ticks delay. In front of that repeater, place a block like that. And then place a torch on the side of that block like that. Then place a block on top of that torch. A torch on the side of that block like that. And then a block on top of that torch. Then you go place a block on the side of the torch. You go place redstone dust right there. You're going to place a block right there with a repeater on it on three ticks like that then you're going to place a block right there with a repeater on it place a block right there like that in front of this you're going to place a block redstone torch on the side of that block block on top of that torch we're going to get rid of this temporarily and place a torch on the side of that black like that. And then we can replace that black right there. And that is our closing circuit. Okay, now we're going to do the opening circuit. So to do that, we're going to start off by coming over to this side off of this torch right here we're going to go uh, down below this I'm just going to replace these with some stain clay down below this torch you're going to place two redstone dust like that and you're going to place a sticky piston right there facing that way you're going to place an observer on the end of that sticky piston again facing that way with redstone dust right there then you're going to take your a block and you're going to place it right there you're going to take a repeater on two ticks make sure that's on two ticks then you're going to place a block in front of it and then right here you're going to place two redstone dust like that Go place a redstone comparator there facing that way and then one right there facing that way it's important not to mix those two up then place two blocks there two blocks there a block on top of that observer a block right there And a half slab there and there. Now we're going to take a redstone repeater, place it right there on two ticks. Place two repeaters right there. Both of these need to be on three ticks. So you got to click them twice each. And then you're going to take redstone dust and place it here, here right there and in these two spots right there and that is our opening circuit okay now all there is to do is to wire up the top pistons up here for our door I'm going to use magenta clay for this part of the of the tutorial let's see so we're going to start off from this side on top of this wool or not wool clay we're going to place a dust right there on top of that and we're going to place a block on top of that torch on top of that black on top of that 
and then a torch on the side of that like that and we're going to take dust and place it like that I'm going to take a repeater on two ticks facing that way right there and we're going to take dust place it here 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 and in these two spots then we're going to place two repeaters right here this one on two ticks and this one on full delay, four ticks. Then we're going to take a redstone torch and place it here and here. We're going to take a repeater and place it right here on four ticks. And then we're going to place a dust right there. That torch should go off. Then we're going to place a half slab right there. A block right there, a block right there, and a half slab right there. Now we're going to take a repeater right here on two ticks. We're going to place redstone dust right here and there. That's the top part of it all wired up. So now if we come over here and put power to this T flip flop, it will uh, trigger it. So the way I'm going to do that, just for demonstration purposes, I'm going to place a dust right there on top of it. Then I'm going to just place a button right there. And let's give this a quick try. It closes up nice and smoothly. And it opens up nice and smoothly. And there you go, guys. That is the end of the tutorial. If you guys found it helpful and you liked the video, please leave a like and subscribe. It helps out my channel. Anyways, guys, I will see you next time. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.